pop out at your party I'm with the gang, and there's gon' be a robbery So tuck your chain, I'm a killer, girl, I'm sorry But I can't change, we ain't aiming for your body Shots hit your brain, we come from poverty Man, we ain't have a thing, it's a lot of animosity But they won't say my name, and them killers rock me But niggas don't get banged, cause they ain't do that job for me While I hop on a plane, she don't like her body That's the doctor with a new shape, blowing up my phone Cause she just see me with my new bae Heartbreaker lady, love me like I'm Cool J. She was trying to cling on to a nigga, but it's too late. Bust the flight to Cali, rock the condoms in my suitcase. And that's a single dollar, and these fans got a blue face. Diamonds in the rolly, they in AC like it's blue gray. The way that I've been falling should make the cover a 2K. Alright, y'all, so we're headed to church. Morgan is going to church with us today. She went to this church a few maybe like a month ago. She went to church with me like a month ago, and she said that she really liked it. Yesterday, I wanted to vlog, but y'all, I was tired, baby. I was on one leg. It's been a very, very long work week. So, your girl was tired yesterday. I had literally, <laughs> I literally pushed out whatever energy we could to spend time with Bell last night. So, hold on, y'all. This is not... Yeah, I pushed out a little energy that I had. We went out to eat, as you guys can see. I probably should have done a montage of that footage. We went out to eat last night, and then we went to Splits, but we just stayed in the arcade park. It was really cute. It was nice. We had a good time. Did you like it, Booba? Yeah. Yeah, so they liked it. Yeah. You left that ball, y'all. She won a ball. Like on her last point that she had on her card, she won a ball. And she left the ball in the car last night. And now she mad at me because I didn't get the ball. Like, like ma'am, that's your ball. Today... All I'm doing is going to church. Today's kind of like a reset day for me. I need to go grocery shopping. I want to go to like a few different stores. I need to go to Aldi because for meal prep this week, I want to make chicken wraps. And then I need to go to Winn-Dixie to get all of the other things I'm going to be cooking. I need to go to Target as well because apparently Target is the only place that has Smart Pop. I like to snack on Smart Pop and nuts throughout the day and target is the only place that has them in my area which i'm like wow so i need to go to target to get some smart pop and i also need to restock on some hygiene body care products from target i also want to look and see if they have that black dress from janae naylor's collection at target which they probably don't because it was sold out online you never know they might have it back in stock who knows but i want that black it's kind of like a flare out dress it's so stinking cute like especially for the summer so i hope that they have it let me know in the comments how y'all was so we can chit chat i wanted to go to target and see if they have the mini version of the la roche poday face wash morgan was telling me about it she said that it's really good for all skin types i have like dry to combination skin i really want to try that one but i'm just it's very hard for me to don't get me wrong like i will buy things i like to shop I'm not a product junkie, okay? I'm not a product junkie. I might be a... only thing that I will buy when I don't need it is probably clothes, shoes, claw clips, accessories, perfume, things like that. But when it comes down to, like, products, actual products that I'm putting on my skin, I like to take my time and kind of see how the products work on my skin before I'm just swapping out products because TikTok told me to. <laughs> like, that's the one thing I will not let TikTok influence me is change my body and skincare once i get into something and i find something i like and it works for me and it's not breaking me out i'm going to use all of that before i try something new when i do try something new i'm going to get a travel size of it just to see how i like it first and if it breaks my skin out or not and then if i like it better than the old product then i will buy it to replace that old product but i'm not one to just go flock to every new skincare body care product i will flock to makeup barely like just barely that's because i love makeup makeup is just fun like you just put it on you wipe it off like it's fun but when it comes How to is it fun? because it's fun like it, it makes you look cute it makes you look girly well, I, and you I, can I, wipe it off maybe when you're a teenager you can wear it teenager this no like more than that many. <laughs> yeah but when it comes down to skincare and body care no ma'am i need to test the products out i need to use them for a while my skin is very sensitive no so i'm kind of like mm, i said all that to say i don't really know if i want to try it but i do want to try a new 
I just might get it though because I do want to try a new face cleanser. I use the CeraVe which works for me, very gentle cleanser, but I really want something that's going to foam and really get in there and clean. I might try like a travel size of La Roche Posay if they have it at Target or I'll stop by Ulta and see if they have it. Yeah, baby. And then just whatever else that Target tells me to get. And then I hope you guys are having a wonderful Sunday. And I will come back to you guys after we leave church. the baked beans are brewing they're good i already tasted them rotel dip over here and it's really good i tasted it too and ronnie's about to put this on the grill the chicken is on the grill hey y'all happy monday i gotta turn my air on sorry it is like squishing hot like hopefully it's not too loud but yeah i just left my doctor's appointment yesterday was really fun i feel like i'm always being like i had a really nice time i really enjoyed myself like but if i didn't then i would tell y'all but i just feel like i'm always saying that but like yesterday i genuinely had a really really good day like that was like one of the best sundays i've had in a while i have to run a few errands so i need to go to office depot there's one down the street i need to print something out i really need to invest in a printer because i literally always have something to print out like all the time so i'm gonna go to target today get all the little things that i need then i'm gonna go to sephora as well i need to pick up a fragrance so i got a sephora gift card for mother's day that i haven't used yet and i had this little theme that i came up with in may that like every month i think i, I talked about it like maybe two years ago at this point i told y'all i was trying to build my perfume collection and i've been slowly building it like I, don't get me wrong i got some heavy hitters in the collection i'm not intentional about my perfume collection like I'm just not intentional. Like, I'll wait till I get gifted a perfume that I want. It literally has to be on the whim. Like, I don't just say, okay, I'm going to get me a perfume this month. I'm going to get me a perfume this day. It's literally just random. So, I want to be more intentional about getting my collection up because I love to smell good. I love fragrances. I love all things girly. Y'all know that. My main goal for the end of, for the rest of the year is to just focus on, like, signature scents. So, I'm going to be smelling some signature scents and trying to decide which ones I like, which ones I don't like. But for sure, each month, I'm gonna get one perfume and that's just gonna be like my little treat to myself, just to make sure that I'm intentional about the things that I want, like down to every detail. Like I work, I deserve to get things that I want. So yeah, I was supposed to get my fragrance um in may i was going to get it memorial day weekend when we went to orlando we never went to sephora i gotta get my lick back for may so i'm going to get my may fragrance today and i'm still going to get me a june fragrance speaking of june it is what june 3rd so it is a new month happy june it's a lot going on summer starts this month juneteenth is this month and i also have a few things planned as well so we need to go to sephora target office depot and then i also need to stop by the dollar store what did I need from the dollar store again? Oh, you ran out of bleach. I need some more bleach from the dollar store. I like to go to the dollar store to get cleaning products. I'm going to be very strict this month. My water only, no alcohol, no juice, no soda, no sugary foods at all, actually. Like, I don't want any type of processed sugar. I just want natural sugars, like, from fruit and things of that nature. I do drink green juice. That'll probably be the only thing that I drink. I like the Oxy. It's the same brand that does the Oxy Shred. It's Oxy something green juice. I drink that every day as well. So I can get my green intake and I also take my vitamins and stuff like that. So your girl is just trying to get on her healthy lifestyle. Like I said, this is something that is sustainable for me. Really do want to make it a seven days a week thing. But right now I'm only doing it five days a week. And then I go to the gym five days a week as well. So yeah, I'm excited to get the week started. I just need to get everything prepared for the week. It is June. I hope you guys set your intentions for the month and stick to them. We're going to be fine for the summer, okay? I don't want to hear nothing. No complaints when the girls got on their sundresses, they two pieces. I don't want to hear nothing because y'all had time. Like, we all had the time. Go ahead and get your little workout in, even if it's something small. This is ridiculous. The Melo, actually, Melo didn't do this. I don't know how I did. I cut my finger on his cage. I really want to stop and get an acai bowl. Y'all, I've been in an acai bowl choco. The acai bowls from Tropical Smoothie. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I have been in a disgusting choco 
with them acai bowls the amount of times that i'd be going to get them that's another thing like i do want to limit the amount of times that i'm eating out a week to like twice a week so that's actually gonna be another one of my goals for june and i do count acai bowls as twice a week so this is the beginning of the week i have to make a decision if i get an acai bowl today that's gonna count as my one time eating out this week and i just don't feel like it's worth it but yeah y'all so i guess i'm not gonna go get one i'm gonna go ahead and run my errands do what i gotta do and then I guess figure out what I want to eat for dinner. We'll come back to you guys later. Bye. So I made it home. I'm exhausted. I've been ripping and running, running and ripping all day. Melo scratching at the door. He wants me to come out. So I'm going to make this quick. So let's do a little haul of the things that I got from Target. Oh, by the way, I ended up getting me an acai bowl ID. I don't want any beans or chicken for dinner. So I'm just going to eat my acai bowl for dinner and that's going to count as my one of my two times to eat out this week. It is what it is. When I say the Janae Naylor Future Collective collection was, I mean, it was so dry, wipe dry. They only had like large sizes, like really, really large sizes. That's all that they had left. I wanted the little black dress that like flares out. That is just so cute. It's the perfect summer dress but unfortunately they didn't have it so i got this one this is the only thing they had in my size which is this little top right here you guys can't really see like the gist of it but i will pop it on the screen as well but this is just so stinking cute it's like a like a little corset type vibe but i'm so ready to style this and i'm going to style it in so many different ways this summer like this is definitely going to be a look and i'm excited to wear it i'm happy i found something i went online everything is wiped offline i really want that black dress but i'm happy that i got something from the collection i got some rubber bands because i'm about to do vez hair tonight for the week and we were out of rubber bands i got some more eos because I'm like literally scraping my bottle. This is the Fresh and Cozy Shea Butter. I really like the, um, what is it called? The purple one, the uh, cashmere. I like the vanilla cashmere. Like, it's so good. But this one like has a fresh smell to it. So I'm going to try this one and see how I like it. If it's not hitting like that, I don't think nothing gonna hit like that vanilla cashmere, but I'm gonna just try, I just wanna try something different, see what it's giving. I like the way it smells. It smells like really fresh type vibe. I like to eat these. These are the skinny pops. They're only 80 calories a bag. I like to eat these like in between my brunch, breakfast, and dinner. I like to snack on these and then the nuts. So I got some of these. Like I said, Target is the only place that really sells them, the variety pack. So. I also got some more turmeric and ginger tea. I like to drink tea in the morning. I like the ginger and turmeric one. It is caffeine free. I got some hemp seeds to add to my bowl in the morning. So hopefully I will feel full after I eat my yogurt bowl. And then from Sephora, I got my fragrance. So I smelt a few different ones. That, I have it on right now. It smells so good. That's what it's called. Blue Glare, Angel Nova, Angel something. That pink bottle. Morgan had that when she got one for her birthday. It smells so good. Like, I really wanted to get that one, but I just feel like I already have so many floral sweet smells. It really puts me in the mind of like a Valentino. Like, let me smell my Valentino actually and see and compare the two. I need another Valentino too. I'm running out of Valentino. Mm, that Valentino, that Valentino's good. Yeah, like they're very, they're very similar. Like they have like a sweet floral kind of smell to them and I'm almost out. So I need to restock on this. I don't feel like restocking counts as a perfume buy. That Ralph Lauren Romance, the pink one, the red one smells good too. But the pink one, that smells good too. So I end up going with the YSL Libre. This one is giving very much grown and sexy. So yeah, I'm excited about this one. Like this to me is like a date night type of scent. So this is the bottle. Mm-hmm. Pretty sure most of y'all got it by now. I'm late to the party. A lot of people already have this. Look at the little bottle. Look how cute the little bottle is. And that was my thing too. Like I'm as I'm building, I'm probably gonna be getting small bottles of things simply because like I really wanna use them. I don't be using my perfumes as much. And it's like I, they be lasting so long. Like I've had good girl for such a long time. I still have a lot of it. So it's like I don't really need a huge bottle. As I'm building, I'm gonna be getting small bottles, using everything, seeing what I really, really like and then repurchasing the things that I really, really like. 
one thing that i wish i hadn't got well i didn't buy it but i should have picked something different i got this burberry her from the outlets like maybe a month or two ago but it was gifted to me so i ain't pay for it but still i wish i would have chose something else because it smells good but it's just it doesn't last so i need to go on zara and order me another ebony wood because i ran out of that i love ebony wood ebony wood to me is like an everyday scent like i used to wear that every day to work and it literally stays on you all day like it soaks into your clothes so i think i'm gonna start mixing my ebony wood with this so i can get good use out of it because i got it it's really a nice summer scent but it just doesn't last i like the way it smells but it just doesn't last long and i don't really care for perfumes that don't last long because what am i what why are we paying hundreds of dollars for perfumes that don't last but i'm gonna use it up girl because i got it so i'm about to get ready to go eat my acai ball we'll be going to pick veya up shortly and then i'm gonna cook my meal prep and just prepare for the week because the week is about to start as a week is beginning that means the vlog is closing and i know like i say like i just be seeing stuff and it's like, sometimes it's like, it sounds repetitive because I'm always saying it. But if you made it to uh, this far in the vlog, I really, 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 really do appreciate it. Every like, comment, share, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for that. I don't think I'm going to be closing out the vlog just yet. I might have a little montage -tage at the end. So keep watching for the end of the vlog. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Now. Bye. Oh my